Yellowstone supervolcano warning as researchers found giant magma chamber beneath surface. Yellowstone, located in Wyoming, U.S., is one of the world's few supervolcanoes, a volcano that has had an eruption with a volcanic explosivity index of 8. In the last 3 million years it has experienced three eruptions, the last coming around 630,000 years ago, which was 1,000 times bigger than the 1980 Mount St. Helens eruption. Its calderas, the large cauldron-like hollow that forms after a magma chamber is emptied during an eruption, lie over the Yellowstone hotspot under the Yellowstone Plateau. Here, light and hot magma from the mantle rises toward the surface, with the hot spot deep beneath the surface, so deep that the North American plate slides west-southwest over it. Over the past 16.5 million years this hot spot has generated a succession of explosive eruptions but less violent floods of basaltic lava. Today, Scientists and researchers closely observe Yellowstone for any signs that it might be gearing up to explode in the near future. It is generally accepted that an eruption in the next 10,000 years is very unlikely, with scientists having found no imminent smaller eruption of lava in more than 30 years of monitoring. But this has not stopped fieldworkers studying the caldera, creating cutting-edge graphics and models with data harnessed from the volcano, as explored during the Smithsonian Channel's documentary, Yellowstone Supervolcano. In 2015, scientists collected new data which gave them the best idea yet of Yellowstone's underground plumbing. Identifying the volcano's magma chamber from the last eruption, they discovered how it was being fed by a plume of magma stretching down 465 miles northwest into Montana, mostly solid rock but with the potential to liquefy. <laughs> 